What's up guys, my name is Rick and we're back with another uh, Minecraft Thumbcraft 3 guide video thing. Uh, this one's going to be a short one because all we are going to be doing today is this right here. It is called the Unified Thomic Field Theory. And basically what it does, it is it allows you to move on to the rest of the Thumbcraft things and it allows you an upgrade for your wand so I have all the aspects we need I have a little bit more than what is necessary but uh, let's get right into it okay that's done let's get this in uh, this this research requires a lot of um, aspects as you can see but I think I got all of them oh whoops I grabbed the wrong one air wind breath what do we got in here it's probably in the air shards right yeah my bad Boop, boop. And shabam. Uh, we'll just dump a bunch of stuff in here. Whoops. That in there. That in there. And that in there. Or not. Alright. So now we got the Unified Thomic Field Theory. Uh, eight different aspects you need cognitio, solemn, precant, precantatio, mutatio, tempus, ignis, aqua, and aura. So let's see, you may, you may be on to something here. For the moment it lies just outside your grasp, but you are beginning to see how the magical, elemental, and natural worlds all fit together. Knowledge like this could prove invaluable. Okay, so let's right click and we now have the Unified Thomic Field 3. Now, as you can see, those wands were lit up and we have a golem there, that thingy there, and a jar there. But we're only going to focus on this right now. <clears throat> Yeah, formulated a theory on how the natural and elemental world interacts with the mystical. You finally have a grasp on how the aura saturates everything and everyone. Not only is this knowledge enlightening, it has some practical applications. The first such practical application is an improvement to your casting wand. You now know how to create a wand of the adept. It is similar to the wand of the apprentice, except it is able to store much more vis, thus allowing for larger and more complex feats features of magic it also recharges faster <clears throat> so to craft the wand of the adept you need an air shard fire shard earth shard water shard and a wand of the apprentice now you also need 50 v so you're, you are going to have to make another wand of the apprentice so let me just yeah need one of these and one D now I need an earth and air and fire and water I believe yeah okay so first we gotta make our second wand of the whoops apprentice oh god okay sorry about that my sister interrupted. Anyway, here's that, and you also need 16 Precantatio, so you have to throw that into the Crucible. So that makes the Wand of the Adept. So now, uh, it has 250 Vs. So now you can make the, um, more powerful atoms. 
like the Thaumium Grafter, which requires 160 V, so you can go ahead and do that. Anyway, um, that's probably gonna be it for today. Um, today's kind of busy for me, so I won't be able to do much anyway. So, uh, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.